experiment. Some with legs. These things. First shot at hollow form. Not too bad. I made a mess set. Not too bad. The, the, these, the lids, the finials don't fit in there very well. Uh, the legs aren't. The legs are pretty cool. Is this the uh, pre Cindy uh, Frozier? Yeah. It is pre. Yeah, this is, I can't tell you. So, so maybe she got the idea from you? The, no, I don't know if anybody ever saw these outside of the real world, outside of us. And I don't need, to be honest with you, I don't think I ever brought these in. No. How did you do the legs? I don't think I ever brought these in. Huh? How did you do those legs? I carved. They just, just, just cut out on a band's uh, scroll so I sand it a little. That's pretty much it. Um, uh, not bad form, you know, not too bad. <laughs> could have could have made it, created a better shadow on the lid. Could have created a better shadow underneath. I know you can't all see this. I'm sorry. I apologize. Uh, the thing I really don't like about, and this is a fairly good form. Um, I'm pretty good actually. The only thing I don't like about it is because it's on legs. I shouldn't have squared off the bottom. I should have let it continue on, uh, and that was a mistake. Uh, so I, uh, you know, I've never made another one. So I, that, that's another thing about me. I'll do it once or twice, and then I've had enough, you know, and I'll go on to something else, which is not really a good thing. Uh, it's really not a good thing. It probably would have been better if I'd have stuck with something longer, and you know, worked on it more and um, uh, made it, uh, you know, made it a little more sophisticated and things like that, which I could have. I mean, the ideas run in your head, but, you know, to get out there and actually do it is, uh, <laughs> this is a lot of work. And I worked all week, you know, so. Everybody get to see this? Yes. What kind of wood is it? I don't know. It's some kind of spalted something. It's, no, it's, I don't think it's maple because it's, it was soft. But I don't know if that, it could have been from just being spalted. I don't know. But it's interesting, yeah. It's interesting. Uh, Purple Heart are the uh, other, other parts. The finials are too heavy. You know, this one here is the, the base of this finial is not, not very good. This one's pretty cool. This, one, this one's all right. For its size and everything, but this one could have been better. Do you remember how you attached the legs, little legs Jim? Yeah. Uh, did you turn, or how did you make the tenon? Yeah, I assume you had a tenon that went into the. Yeah, yeah. I, I turned a. Uh, I left a little piece. I, you know, I just cut with a jigsaw, cut pieces off, chiseled them off, and left a little stub. Okay. And made it round with a file or something. Made it a dowel. And then, of course, marked out the holes as precisely as I could, and uh, just glued them in. Now they're 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 starting to uh, move around a little bit and everything. But uh, all right. Anybody? Any more? Any questions on these? Okay. We'll keep going. All right. All right, um, real quick, we can talk about, we can talk about uh, some goblets. I used to turn a lot of goblets. This is one of the early ones. I didn't, I, I didn't start doing them for a while, until for a while. This is like 96 or something. And that's pretty ugly. That's really, that's pretty ugly. Ugly. It's ugly because the the bottom here uh, there's no definition where the where the bowl meets the stem. There's just this little nodule here. It should have end. If anything, it should have ended on the uh, the flat. This little this little cradle here. But I I, I didn't. I, I don't like this one very much at all. And it's very sloppy here, nothing crisp. 
no crisp lines. I think the base is too small. And uh, overall, it's not a well-turned goblin. Yeah, sure. When did you start using the diamond signature? I don't know. I, oh, uh, I don't know. Maybe six to eight years ago. Maybe. Uh, now this is another goblet. Uh, This one, again, uh, not very well, not very well done. Um, it's the, the stem is too heavy. Everything's too heavy, actually. Um, um, the where it, where the bowl is sitting, this little platform where the bowl is sitting is too wide, and if, again, it's not enough definition there in between. And uh, again, the lines aren't very crisp on the on the uh, on the on the stem. And uh, thank you. And, uh, did that go could everybody see what I was talking about? Yeah. How this was done? Okay. It's all done on a table saw, by the way, to cut those corners out. Um, and uh, generally, you know, not very well done. And I and I and I kept, but I kept turning them. I kept turning them. And if I brought all of the ones that I have in here, I could fill this table. Up. But I, what I did bring in was one, one of the la one of the final ones. And and there, and it's really done well. It's one of my favorites here. Um, the shape of the bowl is really cool. Um, that, that little platform that the bowl sits on is a nice definition in there, a nice crisp line. Um, the, stem is, the stem is the right thickness. It's a little bent now yeah. because this is definitely taking, this is, the pith runs through this, this one. I have the pith right down through the center of this and you, you can't see it. That was like dead center. And also a very nice little Little uh, detail on the bottom, nice crisp lines on it. The the base is the is a great size, and um, just a, a, a really good job, if I do say so myself. As far as you know, things that I've turned and, and got, as far as goblins go, this is this is really really a good job. So I think it passes the uh, That's small bear. Okay, goblins. <laughs>